Hi, Ty Lord here, and I have been tagged by my brother shark, Retro Tiburon, to do the 10 questions for a gamer, or 10 gamer questions, whatever the heck you call it. So I'm glad he tagged me because I think this is a fun subject, and I've been liking these videos. I've been watching quite a few of them. I think it goes all the way back to Mega Dan. I think it even went back before that. I heard it came from like Europe or something, or another country. Um, yeah, I watched a few of them. I saw um, Dad Level Podcast, Linda the Gamer Gal, um, Oswaram I watched, uh, what are they called, Retro Rivals I watched, uh, Mark the Shark, the other brother Shark, um, see him retro. I watched quite a few of them. Let me know if, if there's any more. I like watching these type of things. But I'll get to mine. So the 10 questions are starting with what type of games do you play? What type of, of games do I play? I, I mostly like uh, beat-em-ups and fighting games from like the 16-bit generation. Um, fighting games I like pretty much from any generation. Um, they're quick, pick up and play. You don't have to spend too much time with them. You can do a two-player competitive, um, or you can just play through the the arcade mode. They usually don't take too long, and they're, some, of them, some of them can be pretty challenging. So, yeah, mostly from the 16-bit era, like Neo Geo and Super Nintendo and Genesis. Uh, but they, I like quite a few past then, uh, more more uh, modern fighting games. Other than that, I like, uh, I've been really liking JRPGs over the past five years. I never liked them when I was a kid, but now that I'm older and I have more patience, I like the JRPGs. I'm actually working on one right now, Dragon Quest Seven on... On DS, I don't advise playing that game unless you have a lot of time. I'm I'm 100 and, 110 hours into it. And I don't see the light at the end of the tunnel. Good game, though. Um, yeah, like uh, horror games, I like survival horror, like Resident Evil and Silent Hill, um, among others. I just I like those because I'm into the horror movie genre, and I I, I like zombie and and horror movies and and. Uh, and those aren't too long. I appreciate games like that for being like four to ten hours. Not too long. I like third person shooters like James Bond and Splinter Cell and like Uncharted and stuff like that. I like third person shooters. Probably more than first person. First person's kind of give me a headache. And I, I like seeing the character. Especially if it's like a cool looking character like James Bond. Or, or if it's a female character. I like to see the character. Um... So yeah, those are my favorite type of games. Probably third-person sh shooters, uh, RPGs, uh, horror, and beat 'em ups and fighting games. For the most part, I I uh, I, I uh, try different games from time to time, but those are the mostly the ones I like. Um, number two, how many, how much time do I spend playing games? Well, recently, because of this stupid thing, I've been spending a lot of time. I've, after, like, the 40-hour mark on this, I really got into it. So I've been, I probably spent, like, like 30 hours last week playing this. But other than that, usually just maybe a half hour to an hour a day. I don't really have a lot of time. E even on the week and on Saturdays, I want to play games, but I end up doing doing other things. Um, so it, it it varies. Like recently, I've been spending a lot of times on on this uh, DS, but usually may, maybe five to ten, I would say. Um, number three, do you think games can be educational? Yeah, I think they can be educational. Uh, for, for the most part, they're not though. <laughs> they can be, but I think for the most part, they're not too educational. They're just like a waste of time that distracts you from doing productive things in your life but but that leads to the third or the fourth question what do you like about games i like them for that distraction it's like escapism i, I like movies a lot I like, I like to watch movies and video games kind of a lot of times especially the newer ones feel like interactive movies but i've always liked them ever since the 80s there's always a bit of challenge i liked um a little bit of a challenge to overcome and uh, escapism. I, I like the, I like the music and the the graphics. I always uh, appreciated that about the games, the like the art of it. Um, number five, uh, how much do you spend on video games? 
usually you see in my, my pickup videos, I don't spend too much. I usually just get used games at Rasputin's. I usually rarely get a new game unless it's something I really want. I will probably get the new Fatal Fury game. I'll probably spend the 60 or 70 bucks on that day one. But other than that, or if it's like a Resident Evil game, I'll buy it day one. Other than that, I usually just buy used stuff or I trade stuff in to buy stuff or... Um, I actually did get a new console. I got a Retron, and I got a new copy of uh, Street Fighter uh, 6. But I use that with my, my work money. I have some bonus points at my work I can use at Amazon. So I didn't really spend that money on that or my, my own money. So it varies, like anywhere from, from 10 to 20 bucks a month. Sometimes if there's some games out I like, I'll spend like 100 Um, uh, What's your favorite console, number 6? Uh, you can, there can only be one answer for these, remember, so I'm going to go with Super Nintendo and Xbox and PlayStation 1 and Sega Genesis and N64. Yeah, that's my one favorite, all of those. Yeah, because Super Nintendo is always my favorite until uh, the original Xbox came around. That was my favorite for a while, but... Lately, I've been going back to uh, Super Nintendo N64 Genesis a lot, and, and PlayStation 1, it's hard to say. One of those, um, what's my favorite video game? Uh, Resident Evil 4, uh, that's my favorite game. It, it has been for about 20 years. Uh, when I was a kid, it was always Super Mario 1, 2, 3, and World. Those were always tied for my favorite game. I couldn't place one over the another. Those were always my favorite games, the, the original Mario games. Up until I played Resident Evil 4, that, now that's my favorite game, the original. Although if the original didn't exist, maybe the remake would be my favorite. Um, a favorite video game movie, I'll give you a typical answer. I've been hearing everyone say this, uh, Mortal Kombat. I love martial art movies, and I love Mortal Kombat, like the characters and the lore. I love all those original uh, seven or eight characters. I like all the actors in there. Uh, it's a fun movie. I don't mind that it's PG-13 and there's no gore. I just like it. It almost feels like a sci-fi remake of Enter the Dragon. I love martial art movies. I love all, all the fights in there and all, all the silly characters. Although Street Fighter is pretty close, I really enjoy Street Fighter, the Van Damme one, um, and the new Mario is good. Uh, the Sonic movies are good. I take my girls, I took my girls to see both of those at the show, so we'll probably see Sonic three at the show. Um, but but as far as like uh, those are movies based on games, but as far as like a movie that's about video games, I think The Wizard's my favorite. So you can only pick one answer for all these questions. So I choose. Mortal Kombat and Street Fighter and The Wizard. Only one, remember? Yeah. Um, well, I'm already up to number nine. Favorite video game character? Uh, Mario, uh, or Mario and Luigi, the, the brothers, the Mario brothers. Uh, they're my favorite. Ever since I was a kid, ever since I first played that game, I just liked the idea of some uh, average, average brothers, like the blue-collared workers working in in Brooklyn, they're plumbers, they're Italians, uh, Americans, and they go to this uh, fantasy world to save a princess. I just like the the idea of that, getting the job done with uh, with hard work and repetition and, uh, <laughs> and uh, solving some puzzles and some athletics, uh, dominating all those turtles and mushrooms and and uh, lakitus and all that to <laughs> and get to uh, kill Bowser. Uh, save the princess just love that formula so mario and luigi are my favorite just, um yeah and they kind of expanded with their characters in the super mario super show i think ever since then mario's been the like the short fat go-getter guy and luigi's kind of the tall skinny cowardly guy so i i've always liked uh that that uh <laughs> those characters ever they're kind of built up from the super mario super show um, with uh, Captain Lou Albano and, and the other guy, Danny Wells, those are my favorite uh, <laughs> Mario adaptations, like like live action. or um, Anyway, uh, oh, so I'm already up to number 10, huh? Favorite or least favorite type of video games. I hate to say it. 
I would say sports because I don't really play them that much, but when I do, I enjoy them. And uh, there are a few I like. I, I remember my buddy and I spent, uh, we rented NBA Jam a lot when we were kids. And RBI Baseball, that was one of the first games. So I don't want to necessarily say sports games because I never really have a desire to play them, but I don't hate them. I don't really like uh, my, my least favorite type of game. I hate to say it. It's um, well, I'm sure there's stuff I like less than this, but I'm just going to say spaceship shooters. I'm not into. I, I think they're frustrating, and they all look the same. I understand they're different, uh, but I, I might grow to like them in the future as I grew to like RPGs. But uh, I can't really relate to it. It's always just some little thing moving around, shooting stuff like like with a beat 'em up or a platform where you actually see a little character you can relate to. And those spaceship shooters, just like some little shape that's moving around, avoiding stuff and blowing stuff. I, I mean, um, I gotta learn to like them. <laughs> I hate to say it, but spaceship shooters, and they're frustrating, and I'll probably rage out at them. Um, spaceship shooter. I hate hate to end it on that note, but I. Um, I'll end it with that. So thanks, Retro Tiburon, for tagging me. I'm going to tag one person here. Remember, you can only answer one. You can only, every question you can only answer with one answer. And, and you can only tag one person, remember. So I'm going to tag my buddy, that video game collector, Alex, who's back strong on YouTube. I'll tag him. And I'll tag uh, Omega Ace, who's, uh, he's kind of busy now, but I kind of like to hear from him. Omega Ace. So remember, you can only choose one to tag so i'm going to choose that video game collector and omega ace and philberto my buddy philbert so i'd like to hear from him he's usually makes some really interesting videos so uh philberto omega ace and that game collector i uh, i'll nominate uh them or i'll, I'll tag them uh, remember you can only choose one <laughs> and you can only have one answer to every question Okay, thanks guys. Thanks for sticking around for this. Uh, I'll see you next time.